this is a particularly challenging time. Uh, what role uh, can spirituality play in helping us deal with these times? Uh, that's what every generation thinks, that their time is particularly challenging and testing time. <laughs> It's the fancy of every generation, it's okay. Leaving that aside, what role can spiritual process play? It is like this. If you want to do anything well, suppose you want to drive well, the more you know about your car, the better you know your car, the better you can drive it. Is that so? Yes? Is that so? Then. This goes for you, the better you know this one, the better you can deal with it, the better you can conduct this to the process of life. Just knowing the surface of it, you are not going to do a great job. If you just want to go to your office, maybe you just have to know where the steering wheel is and where the two or three pedals are. But if you want to put this on the Formula One track, you better know everything, all the dynamics that are functioning in the driving of a car, isn't it? So if you want to be on the fast track, you need to know much more about it. If you somehow want to survive and go, you don't have to need… know much about it. I believe when you call yourself an entrepreneur, you're planning to be on the fast track. If you want to be on the fast track, there should be nothing about this that you do not know. You must know how to conduct this, you must know how this will function at its optimum level. When I say optimum, see right now, if I close my eyes and stand here, if somebody walks into this hall, I will tell you what kind of person has walked into this hall. You could do well with this in your office, isn't it? Yes or no? <laughs> in your business, somebody walked into your place, if you just look at him, you know what has walked into your office, would it be a big thing? Oh, what should I do? What great yoga should I do? No, this is not the quality of a yogi. Even your dog knows this. <laughs> yes or no? <laughs> your dog is sitting under the sofa, somebody came at the front door, he's no, he knows who has come. Yes or no? Why is it that you're missing out, I'm asking? You're missing out because you have messed up your mind in such a way. If you just learn to handle this properly, you will see human perception is such that you don't have to struggle with every little thing. The stress and nonsense that you're going through in life is simply because this has not been sufficiently explored. So spiritual process does not mean looking up or looking down, it means looking inward because the more you know about it, the more efficiently and more successfully you can conduct this. It doesn't matter what, gra what uh, qualifications you have, it doesn't matter what accumulated information you have in your head, essentially your success is determined by how this one is right now, yes or no? Yes. And how to keep this one in the highest possible level of alertness and balance, exuberance and equanimity. If you do not know this, you will be only successful by chance. And even if you are successful, anyway you will suffer it, you will not enjoy it. <laughs>